Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, are we taking a look at some art thieves today. But not your standard typical art thieves where they just steal a drawing or something. They were talking about musical art. Oh yes. Oh yes. People like this exist. People like this exist. And we're not just talking about someone that decided to take an entire song and pass it off as their own. I'm talking about someone that tried to create their own original composition, but apparently just couldn't and decided to take bits and pieces of an actual good piece of music to try and create their own for a Terraria mod for a boss that will never exist. Today we're taking a look at the curious case of Ancients Awakened Music, which, ironically, isn't actually, you know, the real channel for Ancients Awakened Music, because first of all, this this channel literally only has one subscriber, and second of all, as much as there might be an Ancients Awakened Music um, official uh, account on SoundCloud, this one isn't the channel, isn't the YouTube channel equivalent of that, and I don't really think there is one that exists, but you can actually look up the original artist. Today we're taking a look at their one and only video on this channel, which already should be suspicious just to begin with, called Finite Zeros. I can't even say its name without frickin' laughing. Finite Zeros, Theme of Infinity Zero Awakened. Now, obviously, if that title doesn't already tip you off that, hey, this is complete bullshit, I honestly don't know what will, and I don't know what kind of drugs you're on. But allow me to quickly let you know the many different reasons why this is wrong. First of all, the freaking, the freaking name of the theme is probably the laziest thing that anyone could possibly come up with. I'm just simply pointing this out right now. Second of all, Infinity Zero Awakened. As far as I know, I don't think the Ancients Awakened devs have even confirmed that Infinity Zero is even going to have an Awakened form. And as far as I know, he isn't going to have an, awake, an Awakened form. It's just going to be Infinity Zero, and that's going to be about it. But, before we jump into the dumpster fire that is the first 30 seconds of just this theme, I want to just simply read out this amazing description, okay? This phenomenal description that this person has. <laughs> it took me two painful years to finish this, but this time I wanted to surprise you all. I worked really hard to finish this with no previous announcement in order to avoid people asking me when it would be ready. I want to thank all those people who support my work except those who ask when it will be finished, those who have no patience, those who cannot wait to hear the music, those who are really annoying, and those who dislike my work, those who like my work too much, those who- Oh my god, Jesus Christ. Thank to all of you that do not breathe or think. And of course it's also marked, you know, as if it came from Charlie, in which I don't really think even Charlie would even say something like that, because that's like really passive aggressive. I want me to just simply point that out right there. Like But obviously everyone saw through this freaking ruse of this person's, and I'm just gonna simply play to you the first thirty seconds of this dumpster fire of a song before we even jump into the comments section and what I think about this entire situation, cause holy shit. In case you can or in case you can't already tell, there's obviously no effort put into this one. Literally, they just took bits and pieces from Charlie Debnam's actual really good theme for that was actually an official theme for Infinity Zero. Literally, they just stripped freaking the beginning part of Echoes of Infinity and just passed it off as if they made it themselves. And here's the amazing thing, okay? This freaking, this freaking, this freaking theme right here, okay? This was, the theme was released the beginning of this year, okay? <laughs> this, however, this amazing theme that supposedly said, he said, took two painful years to finish, mind you, was released August 13th, 2019. Now, I'm just gonna simply say right here, how can you possibly create a near-perfect not even near perfect, an exact copy of Charlie's beginning to Echoes of Infinity to make this theme, which is two minutes long, 
that sounds like it has no freaking effort in it whatsoever, and in fact just sounds like someone just ramming themselves full force into a wall of trash cans instead of a sensory deprivation tank. How can it take you two years to create something uh, and create a perfect copy of a beginning that didn't even exist yet? I, I want you to try and, you know, fancy me that. Also, I highly doubt that two years uh, two years ago, I don't even think Ancients Awakened was even that well known. I don't even think Infinity Zero was even a concept two years ago, mind you. And also, I highly doubt that it takes two goddamn years to create a goddamn music track that's two minutes long unless you suck that much dick at making music, which, judging by what we heard, you can pretty much vouch that they kind of do suck ass. But I want you, I want to read some of these amazing comments here. <laughs> amazing comments, okay? Alright, Casual Pokey pay Player says, It took me two painful years to finish this. You mean two minutes to steal this. Honestly, that's just true. That's just amazing. Blazon Breaker, how to describe this thing in one word? Bad. Charlie Debnam himself <laughs> says, Please take down this video. If Charlie, the person that you decided to take the music from, literally tells you to take it down, honestly, you probably should. If the person that literally you stole the music from <laughs> comments to take down the video, take down the freaking video, because you know full well that you stole music. You stole this and decided to include it into your own shitty fucking trash can ramming soundtrack that you decided to create. It doesn't even, it's not even so bad it's good, it's just so bad that it makes my ears bleed and makes me want to blow my brains out. Omega Ferret Music, yet another person that creates music for Ancients Awaken, tells you to take down the video. Universe, another person that creates music for Ancients Awaken, tells you to take down this video. Three freaking music makers are telling you, hey, your music sucks ass, you stole this music, basically, you should take it the fuck down. <laughs> basically, every single freaking co uh, comment is basically saying to take down the freaking video. Also, Super Creeper 2222 says, How in fuck screen earth did you think this would get accepted? First of all, you stole the beginning motif from Charlie. Second of all, Infinity Zero ha doesn't have and never will have an awakened form. Last of all, this sounds like actual... No, calling this dog shit would be an insult to dog shit. Ron, hell, and thanks for talk coming to my TED Talk. God damn it, you took my goddamn jokes within like five seconds of it even existing. But hey, well said. I couldn't have said it any better, to be honest. I personally find this insulting on many different levels. First of all, a professional level. You literally impersonated Charlie, the person who created the beginning motif that you blatantly stole from. Uh, you decide to impersonate Charlie, that's that's a pretty low blow right there, buddy. Second of all, I don't even I don't even know what goes through people I don't even know what goes through people's brains when they think that this is actually a genuinely good idea. When they genuinely think that taking someone else's idea for uh, not even taking someone else's idea, taking someone else's music and then putting it in uh, into something like this, I, I don't even know what goes through people's brains like this. This is just genuinely just like I don't know. It makes me want to bash my head against a wall until I finally concuss myself. I just don't even know. I don't know what to say about this. Literally every single person in the comments section is telling this person to take down this video. And yet they haven't. Yet they haven't. As of recording this, it still exists. It's still up. It's still up for everyone to watch and ridicule. Now, am I saying that you should ridicule them? Honestly, no. Don't go out of your way to try and ridicule this person. But do at least try and spread awareness about this kind of stuff. You know, just kind of spread it- oh god, my freaking earbuds, I just ripped them right out of my ears, ow. Okay. But what I would do is at least just kind of like, you know, spread this around, let YouTube know that this shit exists, that they basically stole from, like, an actual good music maker. And honestly, Charlie, I know that you might not be the kind of person that would actually do something like this, but if I were you, I would freaking strike this video to all hell. I would just automatically strike this freaking video, because you have all rights to, okay? In fact, if technically you don't own the music and Ancients Awaken does, then have Ancients Awaken strike it. Have the developer of Ancients Awaken go ahead and go like, Hey, this shit ain't cool. You shouldn't be doing this. No one likes it. No one does. No one in their right mind would listen to this, look at this, and genuinely think it's a good fucking theme. 
I don't understand this, okay? Th that's the main takeaway from here. I don't understand this. And if there's anything you guys should take away from this is, don't be like this person. Don't be a brainlet. Don't be a complete and total dumbass and do something like this. Because people are going to call you out for it. And especially when the person that you stole from says, hey, take it down, then here's another piece of advice. Take down the said video. If it's insulting enough for the freaking creator of the music that you stole from to basically tell you to get rid of it, tells you to get rid of it, then get the hell rid of it. Simple as that. But yeah, that's that's it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please consider leaving a like. I know that this is kind of a weird video for me to make, but hey, you know what? I might as well make a video on this before the video does end up getting taken down, because I'm fairly certain it probably will at some point. Hopefully. But, you know, I may, I may have freaking passed out and missed freaking Halloween, but I'm not going to pass out and miss the opportunity to ridicule this individual, because honestly... <sighs> Honestly, I don't, I don't even know what to say about this. It's just so poorly made. It's so poorly executed. And if this is, and if this was like meant to be like a joke or something like that, it's not even that funny. It's not even that funny. It's not like a, you know, decrease your electronic devices oral output kind of funny. This is just like a poorly executed, poorly timed, poorly everything kind of funny. Because if this is like supposed to be a joke, no one finds it funny. People just find this offensive. And like. In my opinion, I kind of find this as offensive as, like, trying to make a 9-11 joke during 9-11, okay? This is just this is just that level of insulting, at least to me. But yeah, that's it for today's video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, see ya.